It is not the title of a painting that gives meaning to art. A title of a painting is like the name of a person. Yeah? Your name is Amir. My name is Kamal. If we go into the meaning of Amir, meaning prince, and Kamal, meaning perfection, and then try to say, this is what we are, that would be misleading. So a painting should be seen, and what is being seen has to communicate what you say. You don't need to describe a painting to see it. The description of a painting relates to language, to words. If you want to say words, write. But to paint and put a, put a title to what you paint, no, I would, I would rather like to see it, to see what it means to me visually. Because the visual language is different than audio language, the music, as well as the, the poetry. Now, in Arab culture, poetry is the main form of expression uh, in Arab culture. And so much of the painting that evolved within the Palestinian cultural ghetto is related to the concept uh, of, of expression that is verbally conceived, so that you find a painting uh, that, that tells uh, actually a narrative, a story, as if the story is what's important, not what is put on canvas. Uh, what is put on canvas has no way to be uh, explained because it, it says itself. The same with music. I mean, if, if I would give a, a title for a, a piece of music like we give to paintings in Arabic, we, I mean, it becomes uh, endless and meaningless, totally meaningless. Thank you.